Dartmouth is a town that has always thrived on the natural resource of its river, attracting many tourists in their yachts. But there are also smaller pleasure craft giving river trips, and bigger cruise ships as well. Not just tourists enjoy the river, many fishermen still operate out of Dartmouth. The history of Dartmouth is evident from the joining of the sea and the river, with the twin defences of Kingsway Castle, and here, the slightly larger and restored castle of Dartmouth. Although the only thing it defends against is the vast amount of tourists that usually flock to it. Oh, and I'm afraid to say the man in the blue jumper is me. But I have to admit, the view to sea is impressive. Dartmouth is not only famous for its views. These iconic fist jugs used to be made in Dartmouth pottery. But today, that is becoming a new set of flats. The historical and attractive views are apparent all the way into town, with the Britannia Royal Naval College on the hill and Bayard's Cove available to walk through. But it's not just archaic landmarks that add up to Dartmouth's attractive buildings. Many of the older buildings are still used today, from the Cottage Hospital to the old post office, now an estate agents. This black and white shot of Dartmouth Riverfront, taken in 1908, shows the uncluttered nature of the town and the river. Though as can be seen here, Time has not been kind, and many kiosks and flower beds have sprung up along the seafront. In the background of that picture could be seen this building, Dartmouth Station, now known as the Station Restaurant, originally built by the Great Western Railway, and on the other side of the river is the line it was built to connect with. Faster than fairies, faster than witches, bridges and houses, hedges and ditches, and charging along like troops in a battle. All through the meadows, the horses and cattle, all the sights of the hill and the plain, fly as thick as driving rain. And ever again, in the wink of an eye, painted stations whistle by. And it's not just the town and river that hold the attractions. The surrounding countryside, with its sweeping views and rolling hills. Accompanied by the wildlife and farm life, are sure to continue attracting people for many years to come.
I wish I had some seals.